school football playoffs. Now, let's take a look at these first half highlights, and it began big time with Pleasant Grove, a big touchdown pass. That's Perryman, touchdown pass to Xavier Hill in the end zone. Central Clay County coming right back, though, moving down the field. Quentin Knight going to tie it up here 7-7 seven to seven with a big touchdown run into the end zone. You'll see that one coming up right here. That was in the second quarter and made it 7-7. Seven to seven. Great defense by Pleasant Grove as they sack Boyd Ogles, the quarterback for Clay Central. And then we see the MVP of the game, Quentin Knight, once again. This is a big play in the game. A big run by Knight, but he's stripped of the football, recovered by Pleasant Grove before it goes out of bounds. And they turn that into points and into a halftime lead. Perryman again with a big pass into the end zone to Chris Lewis from around 40 yards away. They missed the extra point, 13-7. Pleasant Grove, the de defense stands tough, and it's 13-10 at halftime because Pleasant Grove could not connect on a couple of passes there at the goal line in the last moments of the second quarter. We go into the third quarter, the second half of the third quarter, and we see a lot of uh, Javon Wood with a bounce pass to get the uh, reception there. And then J.D. McNeely, big number 21, Really had a monster second half with some big runs there. Then Knight, a great one-two combination at the tailback position. Knight with a 20-yard touchdown run. That made it 24-13. to Lewis to Perriman, another big touchdown pass. And then a big interception. This was a big play in the game here. Jesse Hall with a big interception and a return all the way back down to the central of Clay County 25-yard line with just three seconds to go in the third quarter. They get to the fourth. Hill with a touchdown pass from Perriman. Again, it's 27-24 Pleasant Grove, and here's how hard hitting this game was. Look at that monster hit by the Pleasant Grove Spartans. And here is a big play in the game. A high snap, gets it off, touched by Pleasant Grove. Clay Central recovers, and then they hit Javon Wood with a pass that takes it all the way down to the one-yard line. On the next play, J.D. McNeely takes it in for the touchdown and the lead, and then great defense at the end of the game. Great defense, and especially right here, Perryman trying to get into the end zone, knocked down at the half-yard line as the game ends. The celebration zone, Danny Horn for the eighth time hosting a blue map. He sets the record. No team, no coach has won more state championships in state history than Danny Horn. Eight touchdowns, or I should say eight touchdowns.